Hi, this is Nellie Deutsch, and today I'm going to show you how to create an account on Kahoot. I know this may sound easy enough, but many are having problems with the free accounts. And then I'm going to show you how to create a challenge so you can share it with the world. Or, you know, if you've got specific people that you'd like to share it with, it's done in the same way. So first I'm going to go to Kahoot dot com and then sign up for free <clears throat> yes everything is completely free it really is so no need to pay anything so let me do that i've got a few accounts for these demo purposes but that's okay i'm going to choose you can either choose student or teacher i wouldn't use anything else because they may ask you for money so even if you think that you're a professional and you don't want to pay then just use teacher or student. I prefer student. All right, then this is really an important part because if you're under age, you will not be able to change this and you'll have to get your parents' permission. So I'm talking to anyone who's over the age of 16. All right, so my birthday is August. And the day that I was born, I'm going to show you, but not the year, if you don't mind. I'll keep that to myself. So I'm going to add a username. So this time I'm going to write Nelly Deutsch. Hopefully there isn't one with that. Um, let me just uh, check. Oh, it gave me a... Okay, so let me do that again. Continue. And it's already there. All right, so let me add Dr. Nelly Deutsch. I'm sure there isn't another one like that. Okay, yay. All right, now I'm going to choose one of my emails and here the one that I haven't chosen yet. So I'm going to continue with Microsoft. So let's go on to next. And hopefully it has my password saved on the system so I don't have to there it's going through the process so here it comes my new account free account okay now you're going to get this um tool okay but we want the free so go to the free okay click on continue for free and keep it free right now we've got lots of things here so explore but ignore the upgrade you do not want to upgrade all right and you can create everything else but we're going to go to the top right unless you already have cahoots and then you can use those you can also take somebody else's cahoot duplicate it and use it as your own if they've made it public all right so let's go into the create and notice there's the upgrade. Ignore it, unless you want to. All right, so let's go on to create. All right, now notice you've got a choice here, so choose whatever you want. I am simply going to go to create, because I'm sure the other ones are templates that may charge. All right, so I'm going to add a question. Let me go into the images because I like their images. <laughs> their image library is actually great. In fact, it's better than mine. So uh, let's take off. Okay, so we're going to take off. And I'm going to ask a question. Now, notice I can change the time limit over here. That's up to me. I can have a single or more multiple answers. This is my question bank where I can add questions, okay, or go to the bank. Lots of information here. Take a look at it. Use it if you need it. And if not, don't. So let me just add one question. And my question is, are you... Now, I know a lot of people are because I keep getting messages. So the answer will be yes, no, sometimes and okay and the answer is not single so let's go into this one here it's not a single answer obviously so let's change that to multiple select now notice what i get up here multi select is a kahoot family feature tried for free start a free trial ignore that 
Okay, ignore that. So let's just uh, click on these. All of them may be true. All right, next I'm going to go to done. And let's see what happens because this message is very suspicious. All right, done. Okay, the title is going to be to click on continue. Here it comes, validating. Now notice what happens here. It says upgrade to host this Kahoot or continue upgrading. Now the problem here is the message. Okay, so let's get rid of multi-select because it has a crown, which means that it costs money. <laughs> all right, let's go back to single. And for single, we're going all the answers correct anyways. Okay, let's see what happens with that. Done. Now we're going somewhere. Uh, yeah, this code is ready to go. Test it. Share it with others. All right, so let's share it with others. Notice there's nothing here because we can't share it. So back to edit. We need to go to the settings to make it public or we can't go anywhere. So let's click on that. Settings. Remember, I was in the settings. Now we're going to go to everyone and then we're going to click on done. Everyone. Done. All right. Now we're going to go back to done. Okay. Notice it takes time. Done. Now we're going to share it with others. Now we have a link. Amazing. All right. So now the link is available. And we're going to play now. I hope you got that. Play now. And then we're going to go to the challenge. Play now and then challenge. Practice? No. Click on the challenge. I don't want to practice. Now we can decide on the time. Now this is really important. Not the time, but the date. You want to give people enough time to be able to play it on their own. I usually give them a couple of weeks. Time doesn't really matter to me. Randomize answer. There's only one question. All right. And remember to create. And no upgrading. All right. We don't want to do that. This is enough time for them to play. All right. So now here it comes. This is what we're going to share. The challenge link, not the other one. So we're going to copy the URL. We can also send it to Facebook and Twitter. All right. That's up to you. You can also change the deadline, but I wouldn't do that right now. But you can always continue extending it if you can. All right, so uh, let's copy the link. Notice there's also the pin game, game pin, but you don't need that because it's actually on your link. And if you don't believe me, here it goes. Let's copy it. We're going to go into another browser window. Here it goes. We're going to paste it in our browser window. I'm using Chrome. Here we go. It's coming up. And here's the game, ready to go. But there's only one question. I hope you don't do this to you. Okay, only one Kahoot or not. So let me add my other username. I have another one. All right, but anyone can do it. I don't think you even need an account. You don't need an account. So Kahoot or not, yay. And notice, remember I had lots of um, options and they were all correct. But So whatever I click on is going to be correct. Yay. All right, <laughs> because they're all, even though I didn't choose the multi, I still got to multi. And that's an achievement, right? To fool the system in order not to pay. So you can do the same. Remember that. All right, so there I am. Now notice there's the link here that I can come back to see if I'm still at the top. All right, so it's the one that gets the fastest. And notice it's open for 27 days for free. And I think that's plenty of time, especially since, uh, you know, it's just one question. And that's it. I hope this has been of help. But if you have any questions, feel free to add them to the comment box below and subscribe to my channel for more. Ask questions. The more questions, the better for you and for me, because we learn from each other.